Welcome viewers, welcome to our channel. A brawl broke down in Turkey's parliament Friday after lawmakers conveyed to discuss the status of jailed opposition figure controversially stripped of his parliamentary immunity earlier this year. There were a meeting after the country's constitutional court earlier this month struck down parliament's decision to outcast Atli from the parliament seat. Lawyer and right activist Atli was deprived of his seat in the January following ill-tempered parliamentary session despite efforts by fellow leftist deputies to halt the proceedings. He was one of the seven defendants sentenced to 2022 to 18 years in prison following the controversial trial that also saw the award-winning philanthropist Osman Kavala jailed for the life. From a prison, 48-year-old Atli ran to sit in a parliament representing the earthquake ravaged Hatay province in last May's general election. He was elected as a member of the leftist workers' party for the Turkey, which has three seats in the parliament. But the election will lead to a legal standoff between President Recap Tawip Edgon's supporters and opposition leaders that pushed Turkey to the verge of constitutional crisis last year. Parliament's decision in January to outcast Atli came after ruling by the Supreme Court of Appeals that upheld his conviction, clearing the way for the move to strip him of his parliamentary immunity. But in August 1st, the Constitutional Court, a body in charge of reviewing whether the judge's ruling comply with the Turkey's basic law, published its ruling on the case. It ruled at least ouster as member of the parliament was null and void. On Friday, TIP deputy Ahmed Sheikh defended at least against the attacks on him by ruling party lawmakers. It is no surprise that you can call Atli a terrorist, he said. All citizens should know that the biggest terrorists of this country are those seated on those benches, he said, indicating the ruling majority. Bureau report.